Welcome back to Minecraft Survival with the Rude Man. And I guess there's no putting it off. I got to get back to the slime machine. So we're going to get right at it. Uh, in between episodes, I made a, a bunch of signs. Um, I, I need to make some jack-o'-lanterns. And I need to make some iron blocks. So let me get that done before we get started. And I think I, I, think I figured out why... Golems were sp uh, spawning on the ground. I don't think they are. That little um, that little thing that I started there, I think, may be close enough to the villagers that they were spawning on top of that. So I put slabs on top of it so they couldn't slaw. Uh, they couldn't uh, spawn on that. They can't spawn on this. It's got. Well, they might be able to spawn on. No, they can't. That's too tall. Yeah, that could only be the, that's the only place they could be spawning in, and it may be close enough to the villagers that they, that that's what they were doing, spawning on that and then falling off, because I just had to kill another one a minute ago. So, anyway, I've got to do some jack-o'-lanterns and the iron, because I need to make iron golems down there, and I'm not quite sure. I need to make at least six or seven of them. So... Uh, to make an iron block, you need nine uh, iron ingots. So, let's do this. I still don't have enough. I should have got more. All right, let's see how many I get with that. Eight, that's not enough. Let's see, I need, uh, how many do I need? Let me think this through. Eight, let's see, take an iron block. It's getting dark on me again. I always come in when it's getting dark, or either that or it's always getting dark. Let's see, you put that, that, and that. Okay, whoops. Okay, so it takes four to make one golem. So I could only make two golems. That ain't enough. Let me run and get... Ah, dang it, I'm closer to the bed. Sorry about that. Okay. So I need more iron. And I might as well make it into blocks anyway. It's easier to store them. Because if you think about it, it takes nine ing ingots to make a block. So if you start getting that chest full of ingots, you know, you can really cut the storage down if you just make blocks out of them. Let's see, do I have any in here? Yeah, I got some in here too. Well, I don't have room. Never mind. My inventory is full. So let's see how many we got here. I don't think I've got nine stacks. I don't. So I'll do it this way. See how many I get? Okay, I got 40 now. So that means I can make 10 golems. I won't need that many. So let's put these away. Put these away. Oh, I got a bunch of junk I can get rid of. Let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of. Get rid of that. I don't think I need those. I do need the signs. Let's see. Let me fill this up. I need slabs. I don't need the dirt. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, by the way, I found my seeds. I only had six. Melons. Melon seeds. only had six. And I planted them over here, and they're growing. So, there you go. We got melons now. I still haven't got back to figure that out yet. But, anyway. We're going to need to... Let's just make a bunch of jack-o'-lanterns. Uh, I need my shears. Uh, 
Okay. Really? They're that hard to get? Oh, they're not with an axe. That was weird. Okay, uh, let me put the shears away. Don't need them. And um, let's see, where'd that bucket go? I might need water. Let's run down and fill the bucket. I don't know where that music comes from, but it scares the snot out of me every time I hear it. Okay, let's see if we've got company down here. I hear something. Oh, he's up on the pad. He's coming for me. Oh, shoot. I didn't bring any scaffolding. Oh, I need scaffolding. Oh, it's just a little one. And then there's many little ones. All right, so let's get this figured out. I need to to b do the uh, killing area here, and let me. Oh, I brought some of this too. Uh, here's I didn't need a hoe. Oh, I don't need a hoe. Uh, I want this lit up because I don't want other things uh, spawning in here. Um, slimes can can. Uh, spawn in the dark or in the light it's not a problem but what I was going to do was use the glowstone and uh, kind of replace those with the glowstone and see now this one up here if I do this one up here it's going to put a ceiling and a floor light in so like that pretty cool huh but hey that's a that's a finishing up thing in my in my opinion the um, torches will be fine for now let's get rid of this all right I can't remember how high I want this but I think it's at least three because I want the big the big slimes to be able to get in Now, notice how I'm not all that concerned with iron anymore. Pretty funny, huh? Okay, any place I have to build, I'm going to build uh, with the fancy blocks. So, we can be working here. Let's uh, put those in. Um, I, know, I, I have to go back further than that, but I want to kind of start cleaning this up a little bit. Oh, shoot. Didn't mean to do that. Of course, this is on the inside. Nobody's going to see it. Well, you will. You're going to be able to see it because I'm going to have a glass wall across here so we can watch them being killed. Cool, huh? Okay, so anyway, where was I? One, two, three, four, five. And then one, two, three, four. I'm going to go in four. And beautify it. Okay. And this side, one, two, three, and four. Let me finish this up. Okay, so for now, uh, let's do the ceiling. Uh, 
Right, we'll just keep it. Keep it all keeping on. Okay, so that we have. Now, we're going back one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So, we're going to have that. That's where I want to go to. And this is going to go up a lot higher. Okay, so 10, and then this got to go in here. One more. Okay. Now, one of the things I didn't bring down is glass. I want to want to build with glass. These walls are going to be here, so I can do that right now. But then I'm going to run upstairs and get some glass. One. Because this wall is going to be a glass wall. And it's going to go higher. But I'll just do this a little bit right here and then go get the glass. Get that cobble. What? My inventory full? Okay. I'm going to go get some glass. I'm going to empty out my inventory, and I'll be right back. I'm back. That little guy sure makes a lot of noise, but I don't think he's the only one. Oh, there's somebody. Oh, there's a big one. Hey, big boy. Oh, my God, there's two of them. This thing's spawning like crazy. I might have trouble building this. I'm going to have to block this off. Leave me alone. Go away. Okay, so this isn't the only trouble I've had. When I went up to get the glass, it was nighttime. Why I still went up, I don't know. I was stupid. When I got to the top of the water elevator, there was a skeleton right in front of me started attacking me, so I ran around the corner uh, towards my furnaces, right there where I sleep, and uh, there were two creepers, and both of them blew up at the same time. It just destroyed everything. Just everything. Oh, it was just awful. All right, well, let's get on with it. That's my sad tale of the day. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that's about right. Okay, so... Um, I got something to talk about, though. Remember when I first started building this and I cleared this whole room out and then I said, oh, my God, I screwed up. Now I got to build it all back again. Here, Somebody asked me, uh, a friend of mine said, why, how, why did you clear so much out? And I said, well, I didn't really plan to clear it all out. This is what I did right here. I walked up. I walked into this area I knew I had to clear it out, right? I walked up to it and I just stood still like this. And all I did was mine as far as I could mine. That's as far as I can reach. And I did that through the whole area. And that's when I come back to show you how much I'd done. And I didn't realize that I shouldn't have done the inside here. Oh God, they're after me again. Okay, so let's see. I only need to go five. One, two, three. Oh, that hurt. One, two. Oh, for crying out loud. Let's try this side. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I need to go one more. So I'm going to have to get up. But let's, uh, let's take care of this jump. So that's what I did, is I just I just went around like this.
that's going to be a problem. All those slimes attacking me every time I turn around. I would have to hit a look there's a bunch of it it's up there too all right let's do it this way yeah I have no idea how much of stuff I lost up there when those things attacked those those stupid uh scary creepers i have no idea i lost a ton of stuff they just blew it up i had to replace all the furnaces the blast furnace the cook stove uh i got two or three chests blew up that i lost most everything out of fortunately on that end was just dirt and cobblestone but gravel hung up there somehow weird all right we're gonna fill that in now you know why I was cooking all that stone right I'm gonna have to get up there and and uh, fix that anyway so Let's just take care of this. Look, I'm down to my last brick. Well, my last two stacks now. Okay, I've got to I've got to build up here, so I'll I'll get that ceiling at a later date. But um, let's clean this up here. Okay, so this is coming out right here. That's going to be glass. Oh, he sees me. Get through that, fatty. Whoa, shoot. Yeah, let's see. We're going to do... You're going to be able to see that through the glass. So, take that out. Oh my god. Is this... Is this farm always going to be this busy? Maybe I only needed two pads instead of three. The last time I built one, I built it uh, all the way up to level 40, and I don't remember getting that many. Gee whiz. Okay, so uh, the glass is going to go here. I'm going to go ahead and clear this out. And uh, that's going to be an... Oh, jeez. I may have to uh, dig in that way and move my stuff down there. What's in here? Uh, all right, let me take these out. Put them in storage. For now, I'll put all this stuff in storage. And let's uh, finish cleaning this out. Then I'll start building. Now 
Now that I know this is going to be the entrance to my slime farm, I want to make it open so we can see it when we get off the elevator. It's a feature. Know what I mean? Oh, the little ones are getting through. He must have beat himself up against that wall till he broke down. Interesting. Okay, so let's see here. Um, we're going to be building up. I brought some scaffolding. Okay, so the wall goes there. Let's see. Wall goes there. So... Oh, jeez, you scared me. Okay, so there's the center one. I'm going to leave that for now. I lied. Let's put it back. Okay. All right, let's get rid of that block. Man, we're going to replace it with a piece of sand right there. And then put a chest in right there. And we're going to going to get uh, one of those in. There, 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 there. Put one in there, one in there, there, and there. Now a piece of cactus is going to go here, but I have to do something before I do that. Oh my god. This is getting to be a little bit... Oh, I wonder if the creeper came from up there. I'll bet. I'm getting kind of nervous about those. I wonder if I shouldn't close them in until I can get done working here. Bye. Man. Okay, let's uh, let's get some cobble. Those silly mobs were driving me nuts. Uh, I got blown up by a creeper. I don't know where he came from, so I lit this area up a little bit. You can no notice it's getting dark in there. I think I think he fell out of the ceiling because I had to open that whole wall was open up there. Those guys are driving me crazy, so I walled them in until I can kind of get this thing ready. I uh, need to put in... Let's see here. One, two, three, three, four, and then a slab. All right. Boom. That hurt. And now I can take that down. All of that comes down. And then what goes on the sand is three pieces of cactus, which I did bring. And then uh, then I have to build up there. So uh, let's, let's see if we can get in here without dying. Oh my God, this is gonna be awful. I didn't have this problem before. The last time I made one of these, the darn thing barely worked. Problem is, too, you can't tell if it's little ones bouncing or the big ones by the sound. I'm going to have a ton of slime before I even get this thing built. Okay, that sounds like a big one. So, okay, let's get going here. I've got some things to do before I put the water in. 
Oh, man. See, this is what I don't understand. If this was a slime chunk, why did I go so long without seeing a slime? Because I was mining down here quite a little bit and never saw a slime. It's almost like all of a sudden they just showed up. Weird. Okay. God, one more. All right, here's what I have to do. Let me get my scaffolding out because I need to get up. Let's get up right here. Well, actually, I have to go all the way to the top, kind of. Okay, we'll start at this one. Now, slimes. They're going to they're going to come up here and eventually they'll jump off. But they have not they don't have a great uh, you know, uh, need to 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 jump off. There's nothing luring to them except for golems. They don't like golems. They'll attack a golem. So, we're going to put golems in here. And so they'll see them, and they'll run to the golem and fall off the edge. So I'm going to put a golem right about halfway between this floor and the next floor so that they can see them from here, and and then the next floor can see them, you know, looking down a little bit. So that way it saves me having to put too many golems in. So let's, let's see. We're going to go about... This is 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, so 8 is not halfway, but let's just kind of do something like this. 1, 2, 3, 4. Um, yeah, I don't want to make it any bigger than I have to. So probably 3 deep. Yeah, three about I went too far. Let me get down there again. That's only three feet. I can jump from there. Okay, so uh gimme that. Let's put up the scaffolding here. Okay. And then let's fix that up before the mobs keep spawning again. Put one of those in there. Is that halfway? I guess it isn't really, is it? Let's go um, that way. Okay, we're going to go three deep. Uh-oh, I got a mine shaft there. All right, I'm going to have to close that up. And three high, because the golem is three high. Three deep. But I need it four wide. So I do need that. All right, and then let's close this off. But I, all right, can't get me now, sucker. Well, he might be able to. I don't know. Okay, I need my fencing. Let's grab that. Dang, those guys are irritating. All right, we're going to put some fencing up here. And then... He got me. All right, he can't bother me now. Right. Okay, let's... Uh... Let me get up above him. Dog, gone it. They're getting me. They can bounce. Oh, them. They climbed that scaffolding. This is really going to be a problem. I need to get this water stream in, but I have to finish what I'm doing here. Bunch of nuisances. Okay, now I need light in there, so let's put um, 
We'll put a light there and a light there because we don't want anything spawning in here and bother, bothering our golems. So let's grab this and this. And here's how you make a golem. You gotta have you can't have a pumpkin. It needs to be a carved pumpkin. So and what you do is you put an iron block and whoops. I need that back. I don't want to waste it. Give me that. Okay. Get my fencing back. Okay, you need an iron block, another one, and then one that way, and one that way, and then you put a jack o' lantern on his on his for a head. There you go. And then now we're gonna finish this off, so he can't get away. There you go. All right, now let's see if yeah they'll they'll be able to see that and I screwed up a little bit I actually should have had that a little bit higher but that's okay we'll make do we'll just make do right let's see here Okay, this one we're going to do a little bit different because that's I'm going to do it up a little higher so that the bottom one's taken care of. We need the top one here and this one. So if we go back a little bit ways, if he can see like his feet should go, maybe maybe they can see him from there. Yeah, they should be able to see him from there. And then this one should be able to see them way halfway three high yeah they should be able to see them okay boy I'm way off I'm way off with that one down there Maybe I should... Oh, jeez. Ah, it's not going to matter. It's, it won't matter, really. Okay, so let's put another one here. We'll put... How many... How many's down from the... Just two. Okay, one, two... Right, down we go. Down, down to Goblin Town. Right, I'm going to put uh, all my golems in and I'll be back. Right, I got all the golems done. Um, I decided one row of fences is tall enough. He can't get over that. Because it's only two. He needs three to move around. And I was afraid that... You know, I didn't want to block the view of him. But if you notice from here, you can see him. This is the top pad. There's the other side. You can see him. So they'll run for him or they'll run for him. Either way, they're going to spawn in here and they're going to see him. You don't need one on all four sides, I don't think. But that's just my opinion. I don't know. But And then here's the second pad. And again, you can see him from here, and you can see him from here. So they'll run for that guy. And then, of course, on the bottom, we're on the bottom pad. That one's very visible. And um, I don't have one here, though. I should probably put one here. So I'll do that, but let me let me take a look here. 
get down and get my get my stuff here. I don't want to lose it. I haven't seen any slimes here for the last few minutes. But oh oh oh, and you probably notice I put glowstone all over the place so that other things aren't going to spawn on there. So and these can come off because there's going to be water all the way around. So the next step before I put the other, I guess I could put the other golem in now. Let me think about that a second. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and finish. I'm going to go ahead and finish this out. So what we need to do is on that pad right there, we're going to put a golem up there, and I'll I'll show you why in a minute. But let me get my scaffolding again. What did I do with it? There it is. Okay, I'm going to get my scaffolding. And uh, let's just put it right there. I don't need to go up very high. Okay, so what I need to do is come out. What? I only had one of those. Okay, I'm going to come out there and there. And then get rid of that and that. And then, let's see if I can parkour over to that. Okay, so this is going to be kind of tricky. Um, we're going to put a fence in here. There. 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 Let me jump back over. There, there, and there. Now, let's, uh, now let's see. Let's go up if I can. All right. And, oh boy, how am I going to do this? Boy, this might be a problem. I, I don't remember how I did it. But I gotta get that thing. Oh, shoot. That's scary. That thing looking at me. And then I lost it. Dang it, I keep hitting the wrong keys. I, I think I explained to you one time, I've got a hold of set up in front of me. So my keyboard's way over on the side and and I I have to really lean to, to reach the keys I need. Alright, let's see. There he goes. Oh shoot. Stay up there, stay up there. Stay up there. Okay, ah, uh, damn it. Stay, don't move. Don't move. Oh, jeez. Where'd my fencing go? Get back. Okay, have I got him in? Uh, let's see, one, one, two. One, two. He doesn't need all that. Let's get... i got to pin him in a little bit better. Man, I messed this up. Get over, buddy. 
Come over this way. Can you move? I don't want to hit him, but I need that fence in a little closer to him. Yeah, one, two. I need... This has got to go. It's got to go that way, and... One, two... Yeah, this got to go. Let me get rid of this one. And then that's got to go. He's got to get over. And I can't make him go over. Without hitting him. And I don't want to do that. I don't think he can fall, but... Come over this way. Oh, damn it. Did he move? Did he move? No. <laughs> move. Move. Alright, hang on. I'm going to make him move. All right, I got him to move the hard way. I had to break into the ceiling, jump on the fencing, and push him. So now I got to put the blocks back in that I took out. And then take the fencing out. That's one way to do it. That's not the way you're supposed to do it. But hey, we got her done. Now, that I got that done. The whole object of that is we're going to put a cactus here. The water's going to come from that side and that side and it's going to push the the slimes into this room. There's going to be a cactus there. The water the water pushes up to this. But then what do they do? Cuz they're just bouncing around. What's going to what's going to make them not go back in or whatever? They're going to see that golem, and they're going to go for it, and they're going to try to get him all the time bumping into the cactus that's killing them. So that's what the cactus is for. I like it a lot better than the, than the uh, lava. So we're going to put that and that and that right there. It's not going to grow any farther because of the block, I don't think. But even if it does, that doesn't matter. So that's what that's all about. Now the only thing we got left to put the water in. So that's going to be a job. Uh, first of all, do I have all my buckets? I do. Okay, so what we have to do is we have to have a constant flow. We're going to start over on this side. Right here. And there. One there. And then one in the middle here. Now that's going to make it flow constantly both ways. But you notice we're at a um, we're at a junction here. So what I need to do is this. I need to get signs. So let's go back. Now in the old days, you, oh, I still got to put another golem in. I better do that before I put the water in. But I want to try something first. In the old days, you used to be able to put three uh, source waters in and take one out of the middle without interrupting. You still can. All right, so that's good. So that I can fill my buckets back up. If I'm careful, careful. Okay, so here's what we're going to do to get that water to go around the corner. 
Uh, we're going to take our pressure plates and we're going to put them right like that, except for that one. Oh, I got rid of my axe. Uh, with that one, we're going to need a block there. And then, this is where the signs come in. Let's get that axe back. Okay, now what we have to do is we have to put a sign in, like here. Is that right? Sign there? Yeah, sign there, sign, th sign here. And you have to crouch to do this. Okay, now that we have that, we can now put a water block here and there and on top of that block there. And that's going to bring our water around as you see. But now I got to get rid of that block right there and put the, and put the pressure plate back in. Okay, and then, if you notice, uh, we're, it, it pushes you into the corner here, notice? So you, actually, if you had something, they could hide right here, and they're not being moved. All right, so I'm going to have to go back and get my water out of this one, because that works. Right there, and right there, that one works. But no, no, we need to make the water come this way, so the way you do that is you put a water bucket there and probably also right there. Now, that's going to push you all the way around and back down this way. Now we're going to do the same thing, only we're going to do it right here, like that. And then put our signs up. Crouch, crouch. Why it won't let me do it? Why is it? Not? Oh, that. Okay, so there's that. Then we have to replace this with a block, and then put our water back in. But I don't have any water, so I got to go back and get some more. It certainly is. Okay, one there. Um. One there, and one there, and then break the block, put in that, and we're heading down the river here. Now, what I'm going to do, oh crap, we're in trouble. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and make the water come the other way, and I'll be back. I've got the water at each corner now, so let me continue on here. Got one there, one there, and and one there, and then block out. Place my thing. Now it's going around the corner just fine, except for again we got a problem here. And let's see, let me get some more buckets. Glad I brought all these buckets of water. I remember when I didn't have any buckets. Okay, one there, one there, and one there, and that should bring it in. Okay, now I'm going to have to take it that way, but that's, that's another issue. Let's see if I can get this around the corner, but... Um, scaffolding. Put the sword away. I'm going to regret doing that, I know. All right. Let's see if I can get a quick, uh, easier way to get that water. I've been swimming all the way back here to get this water right there. While I'm here, let's fill the other buckets. Okay. Nice thing these buckets they stack when they're empty. All right. 
Now I'm getting confused between the stomp stomp of the of the golems and the slimy sounds. They both sound gigantic. Okay, this one's ready to go around the corner, so let's do a bucket, a bucket, and a bucket. And then get rid of that. That down, then we need a couple more buckets. Okay. One. Right. There. That, that'll push it along. Okay, and that brings us to this corner here. So, what we have to do is uh, we need to get it around the corner. So, let's put that, that, and that down. And that, that, and that down and see if we can make it work. Okay. By the way, if you notice, I did put another golem up up front here just to draw them this way. It should help, I think. Put that down, click those up. All right, we need to change that with that. Same over here. And then we need to put our signs up. Man, I had a little spiky lag thing there. Okay, here we go. Last little bit. Water, water, and water. Okay, I'm getting pushed that way pretty hard. Let me see if I can get up here and fix that. Okay, that's just about right. It's going to be just about right. So, uh, let me get these put away. There. And water, water, and water. Kill the stone. There. Now, let's see. I'm going to have to put water there, I think. So it's going to push me, push him right into there, but I need water, I think, maybe right there. Because Let's see, let's see. Again, the way to test it is get up in here like, like you're a monster and see how it pushes you. By golly, I think it's all, it's all good. It's all good. That's going to push them right into that thing. Because right, this doesn't matter. Because once they get here, they're going to see him and they're going to go for him. So, I think we're all done. I think we're all done. We're going to close this off. And then we have access to... Oh, there's all my stuff that washed away in the water. <laughs> all right. I think we're done. Let's get rid of that. Don't need it. We got these. The good thing would be for me to stand back maybe about here where they can't really see me. Or, or if it's a choice between me and the golems, if you know what I mean. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to protect myself just in case slimes come in here. They can't come in here because it's too low, I think. But just in case, I'll do this and uh, put something on my head. And I'm going to sit here for a while. And then, uh, let's see, I'll time it and we'll see if we get anything. But I think I'm done. There comes a big one. There comes a big one. He's rubbing himself on that cactus. Yep, I think it's going to be fine. Let me set a timer. I'll come back maybe half hour. See what we got. All righty.
let's go take a look and see how we did after a half hour it actually was about maybe 35 minutes but let's take a look okay we got uh, I had these before we had a little over one stack we had a stack in 26 in about 35 minutes so I would say that's pretty good for somebody that's all by themselves on a server and I only made three pads yeah, that, that's pretty good for three only three pads I could actually uh, before I got to level 40 from the level that I'm at which is level 11 um, I would be able to put six pads so I only have half of what I could do so if you double what I just did in 35 minutes I'd have got over two stacks of slime that's pretty good that's darn good so uh, I hope you had fun if you did give it a like share it with a friend subscribe if you haven't and hopefully I'll see you again in the next episode in the meantime happy mining